hi guys welcome back to my channel <laughs> welcome if you're a returning subscriber thank you for coming back and if this is your first time here thank you so much for clicking on this video thank you so much thank you thank you don't forget to subscribe yeah subscribe to my channel and don't forget to give this video a thumbs up a big one a very very big thumbs up don't forget to leave a comment down below and um if you like this video yes you might as well check out my other videos yeah i've done something like amazing things yeah you might <laughs> I'll be telling you guys today is you must actually know the actual amount we pay in a Kitty State University. You must actually be, be be actual about the amount we pay in a Kitty State University. Like now, where I wanted to 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 to, to come to this school, yes, I asked Google that how much do a Kitty State University student pay for this starting course? Because Again, Google just told me 50k, yes, and I was actually budgeting 50k. Then, boom, I came to this school and I realized they were paying more than 50k. So, you must actually know the actual amount, you must do your research very, very well and know the actual amount your department pays. You know, understand that it is a state university. We pay, we don't pay the same amount, yes, each department we do not pay the same amount. The department, French department will pay the the amount sorry i beg your pardon the amount french student will pay different is different from the amount history students will pay so you must actually know the actual amount your department pays yes so that you will not be confused and you will not be you, you will not be distracted yes and you will not be stranded that's the word stranded you will not be stranded yes so you must actually know before you leave home you must know the actual amount they pay in a kitty state university yeah if let me say this if you're coming to a kitty state university you must know that you don't have you don't have you, you don't just have to sit down somewhere and then expect that you just go to the school boom and then you start doing things no that was what i actually thought before coming i didn't join any group on whatsapp i didn't join any group on facebook i didn't like i literally I literally didn't join anything i was literally on my own basically yes i did things on my own and it affected me a lot so in a kitty state university before coming you must actually join a freshers group on whatsapp or insta i don't know anywhere any social media so that you'll be informed keep yourself informed before coming to a kitty state university join those groups and i'm sure they will they will really 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 help you in whatever you want to do before coming to a Kitty State University, don't just assume things. Don't assume things when coming to a Kitty State University. Do not assume anything. Do not assume anything. Just come with the knowledge and ask people things you don't know. Don't don't be an island. Ask people things you don't know. If you don't know anything, if you don't know your way around, endeavor to ask people. That was what I actually did before when coming and I actually enjoyed myself. I was asking, I asked a lot of questions. Don't be too proud to ask questions when coming. Don't be too proud. Don't be too, mm, this, just ask questions. Ask anybody you see around. If you don't know your way to this place, ask anybody you see. If you don't know any, uh, your way to this place, ask anybody. And again, the other thing I'll be talking about is about your school fees and about your acceptance fee. If you want to pay your school fees, don't pay your school fees anywhere else. Make sure you pay your school fees in school. Make sure you pay your school fees because I nowadays I help people scamming people on internet or whatever. Yes, do not be scammed. Don't be scammed. Don't be that money is too much for you to be scammed. Don't be scammed. Come to school and um when coming to school, bring all your necessary credentials, all your wire resort, everything when coming to school and pay your school fees in school. Pay your school fees in school in a, in a recommended, highly recommended cyber cafe in school. Pay your school fees there and you'll be sure everything will be okay. Not that you now pay your school fees somewhere else when it's not school and you expect things, they, you might be scammed and avoid 
being scammed in Ekiti State University because Ekiti State University would not refund anybody. If you've been scammed, you've been scammed. They will not refund you of any money. If you if you make any mistakes while while paying your school fees, they won't refund you at all. They would not even refund you. That is what I know for sure. So avoid paying your school fees or your acceptance fee again. Then come to Ekiti State University and pay your fees. And when you come, I'm not saying, okay, if you come to school, they would, it is 100% guaranteed. When you come, go to a highly recommended cyber cafe or go to bank and pay your school fees. Yeah, I heard they pay school fees in banks now. So go to the bank and pay your school fees and your acceptance fee. State University, you should know that after you pay your school fees, after paying your acceptance fee and your school fees, know that you are not done paying, you know, you are not done paying your money at all. Don't just think that after paying your acceptance fee and your school fees, you are done. Mm -mm. My brother, my sister, you are not done, you just started. So, know that you are just starting the payments, you are just starting. So know this for sure that after paying your acceptance fee and your school fees you still have some other things you are going to pay for like your faculty due your smart school your um, your departmental due and so on and so forth you are going to pay you are going to pay when you are coming to the state university know that you are going to pay you are going to spend money yes no that was what i didn't know and at some point, when I started telling them at home, after paying my acceptance fee, after paying my school fees, I started stopping them at home that there are other fees I'm to pay my daddy and my mommy. They didn't believe me. They thought I was joking. I had to call a lecturer, and that lecturer had to video call my daddy before my daddy actually believed that the money we are supposed to pay is true. Because no parents will actually believe you. But then, now, now, before leaving your house, know that you are going to pay so much money in Ekiti State University. Prepare yourself. Be well prepared before coming to school. Know about your accommodations. Know your courses, your off the courses you're offering. Know the things they do in Ekiti State University. Be familiar with those three gates I mentioned earlier. The satellite gate, the UBA gate, and the main gate. Be familiar with them. And again, know that Ekiti State University, this top I'm wearing, to so avoid disgrace and embarrassment, you can't wear it to State University. When you want to enter, you, you, you might ask, you might just like pull a, um, what's it called, a jacket on it. Yes, put a jacket on it before you can enter. You can't wear short dresses. You can't wear shorts. You can't wear skimpy dresses. You can't wear this armless. You can't wear skinny, skinny things. For boys, you can't wear, you can't wear, what's it called? You can't wear short too for guys. You can't wear crazy jeans. Yes, there are lots. When you come to school, sorry. Sorry, I had to attend to that call. It was so urgent. I beg your pardon. So let's continue. Yeah, you should know the kind of dresses they allow in Ekiti State University. Like I said earlier, this clothes I'm wearing, they can't allow you. They will disgrace you. They will embarrass you. So just know to avoid the embarrassment that you can. There are certain things you are not allowed to do in school so again let me mention this before i forget you are not allowed to have any form of fighting in school yes it is not allowed when you get outside school you get to your hostel you can actually fight but inside school you are not allowed to fight inside school you are not allowed to fight at all so avoid anything that will call that will cause you fighting in school, that will make you to fight, to argue, to quarrel. Yeah, avoid it in a Kitty State University. What you must know, the other thing you must know is that you must know that the university is not like a secondary school where they ring bell, yes, just to make an announcement. Every single thing, they will be ringing bell, ringing bell, ringing bell. You must know that the university is not like that. So learn to read every sign board you see, every notice board you see. Learn to read every single one of them. You might ignore them saying you don't need them, but then what you are actually looking for might actually be there. So learn to read every notice board you see, every sign post you see. In the university, thing is you must have your timetable with you. You must know the particular course you are offering part time. 
you must know the venue you are going to be having that particular course so that you will not be confused this school <laughs> so that you will not be confused you must have your timetable know the particular classes you are going to you are going to have know the particular venue you are going to be having them and again take your lectures seriously do not miss lectures for anything in this world do i'm not going to advise you to miss your lectures do not miss your lectures for anything in this world go to classes regularly and be punctual yes punctuality matters a lot in the state university be punctual with your classes go there on time don't go there late because some lecturers if you go if you get to their, their lecture or like their lecture theater five minutes after the time, this the scheduled time, they won't allow you to enter their class. I know them very, very well. They would not allow you to enter their class. You have to go back home and sleep, and you miss that class. And that lecturer, if you now want to do it, like he wants, he wants to do it, you now record test. You now give them test that very, very day. Then you know you've missed the test. So don't take your lectures with levity. Don't take them like with just don't be careless about your lectures. Take them very, very, very. You must know your courses. You must be familiar with the kind of course you 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 are offering. Yes, you must be fam very, 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 very you must know little about that course before coming. You must know little about the course before coming to Kitty State University. And after knowing little about your course, you must attend lectures. I'm telling you now, you must attend lectures. Lectures, attend as is very, very important. And if you attend lectures, you must know and understand that you must write attendance. Attendance is very, 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 very important in a state university. You must write attendance. In a class of 300, you know, it will be very difficult for you to like get your way to write attendance. But then you must write it. You must struggle to write attendance in a state university. In a state university, another thing I will tell you is you must be very, very smart. Very, 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 very smart. You must be smart. You must be agile. You must be smart. Very smart. I cannot even overemphasize that fact now. You must be very smart. Very, 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 very fast. Smart. Smart in the sense that you must be up and doing. You must not slack. Like, you must be very, 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 very smart. Yes. And again, another thing I will tell you, another thing you must know, like you should know, is that you should know that GST, yes, GST is very, 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 very important. You must not, you must not, you must not fail GST. GST is very, very, very important. You must attend GST classes. You must attend the first and the second semester classes you must attend you must take their test yes gst is very very important don't joke with gst at all don't joke with gst and esc those two courses don't joke with them at all in the state university don't joke with them don't joke with them anybody you meet in the university don't look down on them don't, don't 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 talk down on them just respect everybody you meet and humble yourself just stay humble because everybody you meet here yeah, they might be useful they should they would they would be useful in one way or the other during your stay in the university in that sense if you want something more i just like i just give this this point because i don't want to waste too much of your time if you want me to do a part two of this video i can actually do it then you must actually comment down below if you want me to do a part two of this video for me to elaborate more about this video and or for me to like tell you deep 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 things you must know about Ekiti State University before coming. Yes, I hope you enjoyed this video. I enjoyed filming this video and I hope you enjoy watching it too. Don't forget to click on the subscribe button. What are you still waiting for now? Please click on that subscribe button and subscribe to my channel if you've not subscribed. If you've given this video a thumbs up, give it another thumbs up again give it double 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 thumbs up and again don't forget to comment down below don't forget to share this link don't forget, don't forget to tell sorry don't forget to share this link don't forget to tell a friend to tell a friend about my don't channel to share this link to your friends to your enemies yeah i said what i said don't forget to share this video to your friends let them see this video if you think there is anybody that would be needing this video don't forget to don't hesitate to send this video to them no don't keep this video don't watch this video alone send it to the people that you feel they will need it let them watch this video thank you guys i love you so much and let's get to a thousand subscribers already